Okay, ladies and gentlemen, on question number 21, what we're asked to do is we're asked to solve a worded problem, and the whole point about this problem really is that you know how to use a system to set it up. So let me look at the sheet. We are told that the sum of two numbers is 20, and the difference of two numbers of the two numbers is 2, and we're asked to find the two numbers. All right? Now, very important thing here. We're not asking you to try to just think up numbers and guess. We want to actually see a work with systems of equations, all right? So come on with me and the snail, and we're going to go down to our work paper. And here's how we're going to set this up. X is going to be one of the numbers, and Y is going to be the other number. So we're looking for two numbers. Now the first fact we're given is that the sum of the two numbers is 20. Now your key word there is sum. X plus Y addition is 20. The second fact we're given is the difference of the two numbers is 2. Remember difference means to subtract. So we have x minus y is equal to 2. All right. So let's see where we're going to go with this. Two variables requires a system to solve it. In other words, we need two equations. And I think, if you'll notice, the way this system is set up, all right, we've got the x's and the y's aligned and the numbers aligned. It's pretty much set up to use the addition method and in fact, that's going to be a wonderful method here because if I add, use the addition or the elimination method, look what happens. x plus x becomes 2x. The y's cancel out, and I'm left with 20 plus 2, which is 22. Divide by 2, and therefore x is equal to 11. Now, once I know that x is equal to 11, I can go back to either one of these two equations. I'll pick the top one right here. I'll pick x plus y is 20. I'll plug what I know in for x, which is 11. 11 plus y is 20. And when I subtract 11 from both sides, y is 9. So here we go. One number is 11, and the other number is 9. And if you wanted to do kind of a quick check that these answers seem feasible, the sum is 20. Well, of course it is. 11 plus 9 is 20, and the difference is 2. 11 minus 9 is 2, all right? So kind of take the snail's advice here. Don't rush through the problem. Take your time, and you'll get it right. We want to see those A's.